I'm Steve Ferrano with Ask a Real Expert. Mind Festival and a bunch of other people are asking about HST training, hypertrophy specific training. Now, I love the name, hypertrophy specific training versus hypertrophy non specific training. That's like saying hunger satisfaction eating versus regular eating. Anyway, I looked at the program and with regards to the level of intensity, when I train somebody, I ask them, how old are you? What kind of shape are you currently in? What are you currently doing? How often do you want to train? How hard do you want to train? What equipment do you have access to? Do you want to rotate your schedule or you want to keep the same schedule? I ask them a variety of questions so I can get a better understanding of what kind of shape they're in, how hard they're willing to work, to achieve what they think is available. With hypertrophy specific training, instead of doing a lot of sets and then resting the body for three or four days or resting that muscle for three or four days, it's two hard sets of bench press on Monday, two hard sets of bench press on Wednesday, two hard sets of bench press on Friday, maybe a set of flies as well. One set of curls Monday, one set of curls Wednesday, one set of curls Friday. And that's supposed to be enough to create maximal muscle muscular growth. The problem is, is they don't take into consideration what kind of shape you're in. They're just making a blanket statement that this is going to get you bigger and stronger. Well, let me tell you something. If somebody's out of shape and they try that, training to maximum or training to failure is not a good way to train if you're brand new to training. You'll be very, very sore and you run the risk of injury. And then training Mondays and Wednesdays is probably too much. But I know this is of interest to guys who are interested in getting big and strong. Guys who've been training a while and they're looking for the best training regimen. I'm not crazy about this training because it's a little bit of intensity throughout the week. A little bit of chest intensity Monday, some on Wednesday, some on Friday. It's not enough. It's not enough work to create massive or excessive muscular hypertrophy. It's a lot of little work throughout the week. Would it make you stronger? Depends on what kind of shape you're in. If I were to do this, it wouldn't be enough for me because one set of intense curls is not enough. I do three or four sets of intense preacher curls and then three or four sets of intense dumbbell curls and then three or four sets of concentration curls all in one day and I'm barely sore the next. So the point is is that breaking that down into one really hard set Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, it's actually less work. And I get the whole argument, yeah, less work, better recovery, more muscular growth. At some point in time, you still have to continue to stress the muscle. Recovery is a given, but you still have to stress the muscle above and beyond what it's normally used to. So if you're training balls to the walls, doing bench and incline bench and flies, or doing squats and leg press and leg curls and lunges and you're getting stronger and you're getting sore, why would you change your workout to a smaller amount of effort, to less intense? I understand the whole concept of, well, with better recovery, you get better growth. That's true. But with less intensity, you also get less growth. So I'm not crazy about this type of training, especially because it's not a fix-all for everybody. If I was training somebody who was in brand new to lifting, I would train their entire body in one day. Not a problem. And then I would wait a couple days and do it again. But with this HST training, you're supposed to train your entire body with one or two exercises, with one or two sets, with maximal effort. Really? When do you warm up? When do you work your way up to that maximal weight? Again, you're talking about an hour and a half, two hours in the gym to do all this stuff without getting hurt. I'm not crazy about it for the reasons I just mentioned. I'm Steve Tarano. Train smart, train hard.